So, we're going to talk about some presentation skills, Basi music and other stuff. We're going to concentrate on certain aspects, as I said, and we'll make some deliberate mistakes, and we'll ask the audience what those mistakes are. It's an attempt to try to improve our presentation in our ways. Correct? So, what I would like to do is I would like to invite Sean, who will act as a chief guest or as an MC or whatever, announcer or host, if you call it. And we'll see different scenarios happen. Sean. Clear. Now, the first thing we were going to try to do was figure out how to use a microphone. Because a lot of people like to get right into a microphone and we can feel a motorcycle inside our heart. <laughs> and Deep wanted to point out to anyone who hasn't used a microphone, you don't need to get that close. Modern microphone, you can kind of. Not loud enough yet? I've only got one helper out there telling me they can't hear me. Maybe someone wants to hear me. Who can hear me? A, B, D, what's missing? C, C was missing, they can't hear me. It's what enough. I put it's enough. It's fine. It's okay like that now? That's the end of the first scene. Just not to get too close to the microphone and, and not to hold it. But if that's a little better even yet, it's going to hear me now. That's about right where it should be. Good. Well, is that all what we got to do for the first scene, you think? So you go ahead and announce and work that, etc. Oh, well, well, what should I announce you? Yeah. I'd like to welcome uh, our host tonight to the stage, Deep. Uh, Thank you. Come on. So what, what, what did I do wrong here? Uh, I tried go to... Go ahead, go ahead. It's okay. You just stay there. I'll lead you after that. What did I do wrong here? Position Sorry? Okay, what else? No, nobody? This is the area, correct? So when you're walking, you're never walking like this. Oh, no, 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 never walking like that. You normally come as an edge. And then you come in like this. Rule number one. You talk about the mic. Imagine the world without the mic. It's bare. Now I know he's a camera, so I'm doing that. But I, oh. So I need a fortification, something to... Ah, I have a mic. And he's talking about this. <laughs> no. Sensitive mics. Very, very sensitive. Pour your voice in. Be careful of owling. There's a slight little owling over here. Yeah. Can you hear? Can you hear? So you have to manage it like this, accordingly. But this is your whole world. Correct? Right? So you can use the entire space. But in performance, normally what we do is we are stuck on one place. We'll come to that in a second. So let's go to the scenario number two. Sean. And even when you go, you go like this. Scenario number two. Announce with the Thank you and all that. Uh, thank you. I've forgotten completely. We had an idea to do our little routine and he thought about it all week, six hours a day. I thought about it six minutes every other day. You'll see the distinction soon. In any case, one of the things that I was going to talk about on my own was how people are so dependent on this technology. Which is peculiar. This is a solution, you know, looking for a problem, right? People used to be able to address a hundred yard radius with standing on a stone and speaking. And now I need this equipment which is making it complicated. Deep, come up here safely. Back again. How is, that a, is that a good way of coming in? 
No. There's a distance on this. We, we, want it we don't need to shake hands. We should do it the right way. Just hello. Deep. I'd like to welcome Deep onto the stage here today. Deep, come on up from Seth. Give Deep a hand, please. And for Deep, I know it's a practice, but sometimes the MC doesn't move. He stands here. He like stands here. So you say, thank you so much, Sean, for introducing me. Please <laughs> cheers by us to see you again, Deep. Have some coffee. So that's how we are showing off people, correct? Mics. Don't fool around with mics. This is absolute nervousness. No. Just be where it is, centralize yourself. You know, just talk normally. Am I standing all right? Absolute balance and stand. Try to centralize yourself. Now, of course, there's a camera, but don't be afraid of taking different views. Coming back to fruit. What mistake did I do now? What I should have done was move like this and take it like that. Small fruits, always be away. Always be away. There are a lot of contraptions today of micro stuff and all that. We have some, we can later on, we can, you know, where you can move around the stage with Wi Fi. But corded mics are the best because they don't have fluctuations. And small flutes. When you're playing bass blues, this is a smaller room, but still my demo. You get a record when you come closer. So it depends on what volume you're talking about. It also depends on where you are. Correct? So, these are the kind of small little principles if you follow. Can you reduce the volume a little bit? I should be sounding. Slightly. Finally, at the end of the performance, you have to thank. So you have to build up a small little story, but it's a dialogue or it's a poem or something like that. The way musicians normally do is, they use two different ways of ending. So either they will have a crescendo like... And it elicits claps. Or they'll have a quiet little ending. Thank you. You don't get out of the frame. Don't be in a hurry to get it out. Till you kind of heard it off the stage. So, Sean, thank you so much. If you'd like to come over and you'd like to say, like I've said, thank you so much. It's so nice of you and things like that and blah, 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 Studio 89 and whatever. And, and wait for him to come. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. And then he takes a word and moves on with life. Instead of what? An abrupt absence of nobody on the stage, right? So that kind of ends our presentation.